understanding that you are cutting that way, that road to procreation. And the second is that we used to loot and rob the travelers. To that extent that you commit these indecent acts in your society and assemblies, looking at it, but there was no answer from his nation. But they said, bring the chastisement of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We are fed up with what you are, you know, sermoning us for so long a time. In Kuntam in Sadiqeen, if you are truthful, bring, bring to us the chastisement of Allah. Qadr bin Surni al al Fasiqeen. And he said, O oh my Lord, help me against these people who are corrupt. And whenever messengers, the angels came to Ibrahim, giving him the good, glad tidings of his son, that is Ishaq, they told him, Ibrahim, that we are going to destroy the people living in this city, Sodom. Verily, the people who live there, they are evil doers. So Ibrahim was perturbed. If that whole city is going to be destroyed, Lut is there. In the Fiha Luta, in that city, dwells Lut also, alayhi salatu wa salam. Khalu nahnu adamu bi man fiha. They said, we very well know who is there in that town. Fala nunajiyannahu ahlahu illa mraata. We shall definitely, surely, deliver him and his family, except his wife, Kanat bin al-Ghabirin. Surely she is one of those who remain behind. When these messengers of ours reached Lut, see Abihim, he was distressed to see them. Why? They had come in the form of beautiful boys. And these, you know, homosexuals, they ran, you know, after them. For them, you know, so to say, it was a bliss. They had beautiful boys there. They could enjoy. And he felt fearful in his heart. The angels consoled him. Don't fear. And don't grieve. We are going to deliver you and your family except your wife. She is one of those who will be lingerers behind. We are going to send down on the people living in this city a torment and scourge from the heaven because they have been transgressing. And certainly we have left of that a clear sign for the people who understand. Because the ruins of this city used to be there, they were visible when the caravans used to go from Hejaz to Syria. The trade caravans, they, they used to pass by this Dead Sea, the coast of Dead Sea. And these cities were situated at the coast of Dead Sea. And now there are no remains. They have all been drowned in the Dead Sea. Vaira Madian Akhahu Shaiba and towards Madian we sent their brother Shaib. Fakala Yaqo Mehmudullah Abdul Yawmal Akhira. And he said, Oh my people, worship Allah. And you should hope the last day, Wala Tasafil Abdi Musadeen, and don't make any mischief in the land. فَقَذَّبُوهُ They belied him. فَأَخَذَتُمُ الرَّجْفَةُ So an earthquake took over them. فَأَصْبَهُوا فِي دَارِهِمْ جَاسِمِينَ And they became lying in their houses and dwellings dead. وَعَادًا وَسَمُودًا In the same way. What happened to Aad and Samud? To Aad, Hazrat Ehud was sent. To Samud, Hazrat Saleh. وَقَدْ تَبَيَّنَ لَكُمْ مِنْ مَسَاكِنِهِمْ And he said, it has been evident to you that there lived the people of Ad and here lived the people of Samud. And Satan had made their bad deeds attractive and alluring for them. And he took them away from the right path. 
Otherwise, they were very worldly wise people. Worldly wisdom is something else. And real wisdom, to know the reality, that is something else. Wa Karuna wa Firon wa Haman. In the same way, Karun and Firon and Haman. Walakajahum Musa bil Bayinat. Musa came to them with clear signs. Fastak Baru filled So they became arrogant in the land. Wa Makanu Sabiqeen. But they couldn't escape our grip. Fakullana Khazna bin Ambihi. All of these nations we seized due to their sins. Faminhum and Arsalna Adehi Hasiba. From among them were those on whom we sent a stone storm. And among them were those who were seized by a shout. And of them were those whom we made the earth to swallow. And among those were those whom we drowned. The first and the last were drowned. The people of Nuh and Fir'aun and his army, they were drowned. Rest, you know, they had different types of chastisements, either an earthquake or a rain of, of you know, stones from the heaven or something else. A shout, Seha. Allah was not to do injustice to them, but they were doing wrong to themselves. The similitude of those who take as protectors someone else than Allah. Their similitude is like that of a spider. A spider also builds a house. But verily, the weakest and the frailest house is the house of the Spider. In the same way, they think that they have woven, you know, round them a system of beliefs which are mushrikana, where they associate with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala other gods and goddesses. So they think that they are living in some place. We have, they have, we have something to believe. We have our own creed and our own dogma, but it's like the house of the spider. And these are the similitudes. We slide them for the benefit of the mankind. But none understands them but the learned one. Verily Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created the heavens and the earth. Bil haq with truth. And it means with purpose. They are not in vain. They have been created with a definite purpose.